We are 150 kilometers inside the Arctic Circle. This is the country I grew up in. This might not look like a climate for growing in. But an hour or so behind that ridge, we find commercial greenhouses. People who make a living growing tomatoes. Which wouldn't be economically viable without our technology. And that same technology can be used to save energy in greenhouses across two thirds of the planet. Which is useful if you want to produce food in a more sustainable way. Our company has been doing this for four generations, crafting materials that can help us live in different climates. First textiles for people, and now for plants. Growers are a special kind of people. They see each new day as an opportunity to grow something. Nothing grows much in a day, but the day soon adds up. And this is how our screens work. I make the most of the natural elements every single day and every single night. Here in California, the growers are facing a different problem. On the other side of the Sierra Nevada, you find some of the biggest commercial greenhouses in America. And as the drought gets worse, their businesses are increasingly threatened by the expense and scarcity of water. Of course, this is an area where our products can and do help. And because climatic change will continue, we must continue to help growers meet market demands to grow more with less. That's why, together with our partners, we're trying to create a working environment where the common goal is better growing. Growing ways that make efficient use of natural resources and lucrative for the grower. This is what we mean by a grower's climate. A place, if you like, where we can help both your plants and your business to grow.